But he said, well, wait a minute, though. I don't care where I am. I know the Lord. Yes, Lord. And that's all that. But see, that has to be imparted at the base. Yes, now, why is that important? I only get you in here for maybe about an hour. And some of you don't come to Bible study. You don't come to nothing. nothing like. So I'm not, I have to be real. I can only do what God gives me that day. But that base is where it should be taught and the foundation is laid in their life so that even in your home, don't nobody hear out in the neighborhood you and them cussing, clowning, throwing stuff, breaking glasses. That speaks and preaches the gospel because down the street might be going on, but then after they see how your children behave and how you act, all of a sudden they need to know, whoa, what's going on up there? So you really what? Preaching the gospel. That's your household job. Your children ain't mad because you asked to take out the trash. Don't be quiet on me now. His household after him, and they shall keep the way of the Lord. To do what? Justice and judgment. That the Lord may bring upon Abraham that which he has spoken of him. Wait a minute, do you see the union now? I, I don't think y'all heard what the Lord said that didn't. Abraham and the children, all of them working together, will bring that blessing that God has promised in his word. And if most children realize that if you be obedient, all them gym shoes and stuff you want, you can get it. Because you got it right here. Now listen now, if you would do it as the Lord leads your parents and you do the same thing what it does that the Lord may bring upon Abraham the, the preacher of the house that which he has spoken of him in other words God can begin to bless even them that, that everybody in the house becomes blessed because right now as a child you're not in no position to earn too much money all they're going to give you is, 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 is minimum wage but now if you be obedient to your parents in the household, then God can start blessing them. And when they're blessed, what happens? You bless. Now we ain't through the mother way. I know all of us get excited around Mother's Day and they get it. But understand what God said in Proverbs 31. I'm gonna read three verses there. You see what I'm saying? In other words, the man must be about his father's business. The man must be who God called him to be the priest of the house. But now, keep in mind, that's a joint venture. Because the children preach, the daddy preach, the mama preach, everybody's preaching the gospel by what? The way they conduct themselves in their home. Because he said, when you got the word in you, then the, that treasure and, and, and that ability, the, the, the contents of that house, really begins to grow. Why? Because you're obedient to God. There's no great mystery about it. Uh, Proverbs 31 and 15. See, see, see? It, 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 it's how God designed it. Now, I didn't write it. She, she rises also while it is yet night. So if the kids come in and say they're hungry, they don't just run them down to McDonald's. She picks a good little sandwich or something, you know. Yet at night and give me, who does she give me to what? Her household. In other words, that's more in, in, involved in that. Think about the intimacy of you, even though it's late or whatever, that you and either your son or your, if you can sit down over a little sandwich or something, just talk. You see what God is saying? This is great. Whoever's in the household, should get up and make that for her household. Now, it's not make that for that child or that husband. No, no. Make it because if I do that, if I sow it, I'm going to get it back. Isn't that what the book says? Okay. Listen, listen, listen. Her household and a portion to her handmaid. In other words, she the boss at the house, got servants and everything, okay, but she don't even leave them out. Now, what do you think that'll do for them servants? She treated me right, I can't help but treat her right. 
the story I heard about when we was over there in World War II. See, they had a 